What's up you guys? What's really really good? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Stacy as a black guy. If you've never been here before, but if you have, ya sabes. Que rollo? Como están las cosas? You guys, as you can tell by the title of this video, today we're going to be picking up my Jeep. So if you haven't been here for a really long time, then you don't really know this, but I recently got a Jeep and I actually ended up going to Jeep LA, which is the CD, Los Angeles CDJR dealership and I ended up working on a deal with them where basically I got my car and in exchange of me showing you guys the process they gave me uh they lifted my car and they exchanged my tires from instead of regular Sahara tires to Rubicon tires <gasps> I'm so excited so basically if you have a Jeep or if you don't have a Jeep the way that I've understood it is Jeeps are kind of like Legos and so you can build up and keep putting things on and on and on and on. Now when I first got mine, and this is on the past video so you can always go back and look at these videos if you want, but when I first got my Jeep I was deciding between the Sport and the Sahara and I decided to go with the Sahara because that's just more my style, right? So see now to say hi, hi girl. So I love the fact that I got the Sahara, it's super fancy inside, it has like everything, it's super decked out, but I still wanted to get it lifted because I'm tall and it just looks better when it's lifted. And I actually wanted the Rubicon tires. Now I know there's other tires that are like super bigger and super fancier and super thicker or whatever, but I personally like the look of the Sahara with the Rubicon tires because I think it just makes it look more like Still girly, but not muy, like muy toscoso, you know, because I still wanted it to look like a girl car instead of just like a big ass monster truck. Today's finally the day where we're picking up my car. I dropped it off about two days ago and they called me and they're like, hey, it's ready. And I was like, yes. <laughs> so I'm so excited because for a while, like with everything going on with the pandemic, I was, I didn't know if I was going to be able to pick it up or if I was going to be able to take it in right away or if we were going to have to wait till this was all over. So I'm super excited to announce and to show you guys my car. So we're going to drive there right now. My sister and I are going together. She's going to come with me so she can help me film. I'm going to show you guys like what the actual... Not the dealership, but like what the actual place looks like from the outside because I want you guys to see everything. So that dealership actually has like a Jeep clothing brand and it's super cute because they have a bunch of different things that you can buy like especially if you're like a jeep person and you want to have like the shirt the hats the everything you know so they're in la you can go check them out they're super nice liz is usually the girl that's working there and she's so cool i love her she's super sweet if you've been here through the whole jeep journey girl you've been following along it's finally coming to an end i know a lot of you had been asking me like why haven't you been showing your jeep a lot or like why haven't and you've been like doing Jeep videos and the reality is I hadn't been posting a lot of pictures because I wanted to wait until I got my tires and my lift and I really haven't been going anywhere you guys are gonna get to see it today I'm still in love with it as much as I was the first day I've already had her for a month which is so fast and it's crazy to think about I feel like when you are having fun time flies time flies when you're having fun in case you want to know i'm wearing my ojito hoops from apalaca jewel which are gonna be restocked because you guys had been asking me and they are gonna be restocked one more time also i'm wearing my ring my ojo ring also from apalaca jewel which is also gonna be restocked because you guys sold that out the first time which thank you guys so so very much i'm super grateful to you for that look at this good girl chimela look at this good girl chimelita this is my outfit of the day so i'm just wearing some biker shorts and this tank top that i think i got a forever 21 maybe or a papaya i don't know and then i'm wearing my gucci bag yes sabe? so <laughs> let's go pick up my jeep wait before we go you guys so denny got me these roses yesterday it's a hundred roses they're so beautiful they're huge and i didn't have a vase to put them in so I put them in the cazuela and he made fun of me. So he went to go buy a cazuela for me. But I wanted to show you guys. They're huge. And they smell so good. He always does so well with the flowers. But out of sync. Te acabamos de llegar aquí al Jeep LA. Te podemos hablar porque tengo que grabar. Ándale pues. Mándame una foto ahorita. Ok. Ahorita en cuanto la vea te mando fotos. ¿Sale? Sale. Pero no quiero esperar el vlog. Ok. Love you. Bye, Dad. Bye. 
Oh my god, bitch, we just got here. Okay, so they didn't put my car in the parking lot. I was like hoping we could see it before. So I actually had to text my friend Liz. Oh, everybody's my friend to me, but I had to text Liz. Everybody's my friend. <laughs> I'm always like, oh my friend. Liz, I'm in the parking lot. Do I go to the store? I'm so excited, you guys. I just got off the phone with my dad and he's like, send me a picture right now. I don't want to wait for the vlog. So dad shout out to you. Hi dad. Thank you for being our number one supporter. You're so cute So this is like look, let me show you guys. So that's Jeep LA right there Wait, is it washed out? Okay, that's Jeep LA right there and this is their parking lot That's like next door to them. So this is where they have a bunch of cars that people can come and see and Aside from this lot, they have like another lot that's like a couple minutes away, but you don't go there. Like, they'll see the inventory online. My car, when I got it, wait, I got blurry. My car, when I first got it, was actually in the other lot. So, I was the first person to test drive it and everything. <laughs> so, I think it had three miles when I picked it up, which is the three miles that I probably took to bring from the other parking lot to this one. So, we're in the heart of downtown LA. Now, if you guys want to know, the guy who actually sold me my car, his name is Luciano. I don't know his last name, but he's the one that actually sold me my car. And then the owner was the one that was like, all right, girl, like, I'm going to do the, I'm going to do this, this and that. So if you guys come in, you can ask for Luciano. He's the one that helped me. He was super nice. And then the actual owner... I don't know that people really deal with the owner that I'm allowed to say his name. So just go to Luciano. And then I do have to give the biggest shout out to the owner though of um, the LACDJR because he was super clutch to contact me and to say that he wanted to work with me and for giving me like a super good deal. I'm so excited, you guys. You excited? Yeah. I'm excited. Did you text her? Yeah, I texted her. She's probably busy though. So. Should you call her? Mm, well, I don't know. She, if she didn't answer, she probably doesn't have her phone. No, should I call her? You guys, I'm like. <laughs> so we're gonna go in. So let's go. Do you guys, do you guys like my face mask? I feel like it makes my eyes look cute. Step on the drip. Well, the drip. <laughs> sorry. So look, this is what the actual Jeep LA looks like. Look. Whoa. Not me. They're super cute. They have a bunch of cute stuff. Look. This is all the gross stuff. Look at how cute. Look. I have this one. And I have... Hi, Liz. Hi. This Hello. one. Do you mind coming up? Oh, oh. This is Liz. Hi. <laughs> Yay. You ready? You guys, so while they bring my car, I'm going to show you guys this like super cool and modified Rubik. It's a Rubicon, right? Yes. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's crazy. It's open, Liz? It's open. Okay, cool. So it's like this modified Rubicon. So basically what they do is they get the cars that they want to keep for themselves. And then they like fix them and like lift them and do crazy things to them. But when I saw this one, I was like, oh my God, if you like Jeeps, you have to see this one. Let me put my stuff down just so I can show you what the heck this looks like. Está enorme. Oh my God. Amy, stand next to the tire. Man. Look at that. Amy's 5'10", just so you guys know. This is not my car, just so you know. Look, stand next to this tire. <laughs> Dude, it's huge. So these are 40, oh, they're 40 inch tires. Imagine how much gas this weighs. But on the inside, it's so nice, look. This like red detailing looks super cute. It's so look bitch, I'm 5'10 you guys. I'm 5'10, look at this. <laughs> Imagine every day you would just not wear a dress. Yeah. <laughs> Dead. So this is not what my car's gonna look like, so don't get excited. Let me see the back. <laughs> well, it sounds kind of tall. Imagine somebody that's like 5'1. I know, five but one. Last time she was like, hold on, because I don't know how you guys get in. Oh. In your car. And that wasn't and even lifted. lifted. Look, you guys. Wow, I'm so excited to see it. Yeah, this one's super cool. Let me show you guys the front. What the heck? 
Okay, you guys. Liz is pulling up my car, so we're gonna see her for the first time right now. <gasps> oh my gosh, where is she? Yes, let's go outside. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm scared. Look at all these jeeps, you guys. Oh my god, that is crazy! Look at it! Oh, bitch! <laughs> Dead? For real, because we're in the middle. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh my god you guys we are so high off the ground the owner actually just came to say what's up which i think is so nice of him i mean can you guys see him no you can't see him in there he just came to say what's up um i'm still learning how to deal with my extensiones okay so no me puse en place but anyway he's oh in sandals. My he's like, yep, I yeah bitch. he's in sandals he's like in his little jeep shirt i'm like bro if i own this like multi-million dollar dealership i would too sis but okay, oh my god. So I'm so excited, you guys, because. So, first of all, they were super nice and they did this for me. And they're like, whatever you need, like, let us know. Oh my god, it feels so different. I feel like I'm so high up in the sky, you guys. So, it ended up being a three inch total. Um, so, it's a two inch lift. And then they gave me the Rubicon tires, which e make it equal to three inches right so i don't know how much or how high the okay so before the sahara my car but without the lift it was like right here and now me saca como tanto así okay you guys can't even see <laughs> i'm 5'10 so this car's probably standing like at 6'2 six, 6'3 six, it'll probably be like denny's height but when you're driving it it does feel like like higher bitch like i feel like i have to oh my god i haven't even readjusted my mirrors <laughs> this is so crazy you guys i am so thankful to jeep la and to la cdjr you guys now i can tell you from the bottom of my heart i love them <laughs> i know it sounds super commercially bitch but y'all trust in me i will not be here talking if i didn't mean this if i didn't mean this period bitch because Ya me han dicho pendejo otras veces, pero ahorita me siento bien cool en mi jeep, todo levantado. Oh my god, I cannot believe it. Amy's here. What's up, Amy D? What's up, y'all? Yeah. yeah, you're vlogging today too, huh? I am. So make sure you can check out her vlog, you guys. This is my sister, for those of you who don't know her. Isn't my car so cool? I love it. I love the color, I love the lift, I yes. love how high we are. Oh, Dude, like, literally, they don't let me. So, what's up? You're trying to get one? And I was like, when you're ready? I know where to go. Yeah, this, aren't they all so cool? They're really nice. They're really nice people, you guys, I for think, sure. I and think, I'm, uh -huh, I was gonna say, I'm not a people's person, but I am a people's person, but I'm just saying like, I can read people very well and they're very genuine. I think the fact that the owner even came out, cause he didn't have to at that point. Yeah. And he came out and he was like, you like it a lot? And I was like, yeah, like, thank you so much. Like, I think cuando alguien está bien educado and they go shows. out of their way, cause he's the owner and he's walking in the streets in chanclas, yep. or shorts and a t-shirt and he's like, we're equals. Like, I want to make sure you're happy and blah, blah, you know, like, yeah. 
I, that's the kind of business owner I want to be, no matter where I'm at in life, and no matter who I'm talking to, because you see, who like you know, right? I'm just a regular customer, you know. So for him to go out of his way to say hi, I think shows a lot. Um, because I've also met people that, dude, when we were buying the car, the dealership we went to before this one, they were such dicks. Yeah, they were such dicks. Like they were like, you want it, yes or no? Because if you don't, then we'll sell it to somebody else. And oh I, my god, like they try to do it that way, you know, like sells that way. And I was like, no, like bitch, I want to give you like money, and you're treating me like this. Right. Like, mejor que me canten bonito, you know, que me traten bien. What's up, bitch? We just got home. Oh, shit. Oops. Bingasu. Oh, no, 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 no. Te caigas. You guys. I, uh. So we just got home. Oh, my God. I don't know why. Now, every time we go anywhere, after like two hours, I'm like, okay, I need to go lay down. Yo estoy viejita, por favor, ya. Acuéstenme, métanme en mi casita. Ya, por favor, no quiero salir. But we just got home right now, and I opened up a package from Amazon to show you guys what I got. So, first of all, I got two different books. I got this one that's called Lun Lunar Abundance, Cultivating Joy, Peace, Purpose, Using the Faces of the Moon. And the second book I got is The 12 Rules for Life by Jordan Peterson. Now, Jordan Peterson is this college professor and author i've seen some of his youtube video lectures he has some really interesting points of view that i like that i liked i don't know much about him i haven't really looked into depth about him but i really liked some of his youtube videos so i got his book to see because i always like to more learn more and more about myself and he seems like a really good personal development kind of dude so this is what i got it's part of the it's number one international bestseller. And then I also got, I got you guys a microphone. So my little camera situation right here, I have the Canon M50 to vlog with. And I heard that if you get one of these like fuzzy mics, like you see back here, that you're supposed to be able to block out wind. And so I'm hoping I'm gonna be able to block out the AC whenever it's on because if I can have the AC on and still talk to you guys it's like a double win you know so let me open this and you guys are going to tell me if you can hear the difference with the mic or not okay so I got it from Amazon as well it's the VXR10 this is what it looks like I'm going to show so I've been vlogging without a mic this whole time so right now when I vlog with the mic oops i messed up the box it's okay right now when i vlog with the mic you guys are going to tell me oh no me quiero parar Abrete. okay there you guys are going to tell me if you can hear a difference so this is what it comes with these fuzzy parts always look so funny to me but i guess this is what blocks out the wind it's cute can you take it off cena just ate her food you want to smell it She's like, what the heck is that? It's not a toy, mama. She's like, my toy? <laughs> so this is where you use to connect it, I guess. Oh yeah, look, this is where you put it into the camera. And then this is where you put your mic. Oh, like this. And then I guess this is the connecting part. There's two of them. Oh, this is for the phone. Okay, cool. So, yeah, let's see. Let me put it on and let me see. So, this is me singing without a mic. Estas son las mañanitas que cantaba el rey David. Okay, let me put you guys a mic on. 
Okay, so this is what I sound like with the mic on. Let me know if you guys like it. Let me know if there's a difference. I want to know if you like it or not. We just got home right now, you guys. And yeah, I'm just going to chill out now. I am so excited for the lift in my Jeep. I think it looks so cool. And I'm so, 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 so grateful to LACDJR. They really exceeded all my expectations. You guys, I do know that they do like... I think they specialize obviously in Chrysler, Jeep, Dodge, and whatever else. Um, but if you have your own car and you want to do modifications to it, I think you can go there. If you have a Jeep and you want to get yourself some Jeep gear, you can check them out there at Jeep LA on Instagram. I'm going to put other links down below so you guys can see them and stuff. But I'm so happy. My car is literally like this much taller than me. And I love that. If you're a tall girl, you know exactly what that feels like. And I have to do a little hop to get onto my car. But it's super fun. I think the Jeep is honestly worth it. 10 out of 10. It looks so cute. I feel like it's such a badass car. And now every time I park it and I look at it, like literally right now we parked. And then I was like, <sighs> I feel so cool. So for those of you who don't know and who are going to ask, I have the 2020 Sahara Jeep Wrangler fully loaded bish in white and now it's lifted with rubicon tires plus a two inch lift so in reality it's lifted three inches higher than like a normal one would when i actually went to go drop off my car i didn't know how high they were gonna put it and i was like oh do you guys know how high you're gonna put my car and the guy that picked up my car he was like oh i think they were doing they told me that we're doing a four inch lift and i was like I don't want a four inch lift because it, it might look really cool but to some degree like i want it to be functional and also the bigger the tires are i do know the more gas you spend and it, it's already a car that's gonna waste more gas minus a four cylinder turbo so it's a gas saver but compared to for example my old car I used to have a honda CR crv it's a world of gas and difference like i don't have much to complain about because i don't really drive a lot which is the great thing but i just think it looks so cool and i was never really like a car person or one to like care about cars but now that i have my jeep i feel so freaking cool every time i drive anywhere and it's so funny because okay so if you guys don't have a jeep you might not know this because i didn't know this before but basically when you see other jeep owners you're supposed to say hi to them my cousin joe taught me that right he was like oh has night out jeep wave and i'm like no literally he, everyone here in la is like so deep into their own stuff that they don't even care to say hi you know and then the other day i saw like obviously when you're looking for things like you're more bound to notice them the other day i saw this jeep that was like fully loaded it was like super lifted it was like super cool looking and i was literally just staring up and deja because now that i know how much everything is i'm like oh my god these people are spending hella money on their stuff right and when i was like just looking at it the per the dude passed by and he was like like he gave me the jeep wave and then i was like oh shoot like i said hi all fast so it's funny because i'm literally like driving by jeeps like waiting for them to say hi to me you know but now expect way more jeep pictures expect way more jeep i mean not a lot of jeep content oh si sí, me encantan los jeeps like i do love mine but i'm not like a jeep connoisseur if you guys want to follow liz um liz actually has an instagram so liz works at jeep la and like she's the one that takes care of their social media but she is so into jeeps she has an instagram where it's her instagram but she takes pictures with all the different kind of jeeps that she comes into hands with you know like all the ones they have at the dealership and stuff so follow her i'm gonna link her stuff down below too because if you're into jeeps and you want like a super cool jeep page to follow she is so sweet and she's so knowledgeable when it comes to everything jeep so i'm gonna leave the links for the dealership for jeep la which is their clothing line and for list for you guys to follow them i'm gonna go edit this vlog so that i can show you guys because i want to post my pictures and show you guys my car as soon as possible oh my gosh i will show you guys the comparison some other time like where i'm standing next to a car so you can see like how taller than me it is but oh i love it so much i feel so cool and me jeep me siento bien cool <laughs> it was so funny coming from a crv to a jeep that's lifted it definitely feels like a big big difference you know but that's gonna be it for me you guys jeep la really came through lacdjr really came through and remember at the beginning of my other jeep vlog i was like i'm not sure i'm so nervous i'm re i'm just really glad that they really pulled through with their word and that they exceeded all my expectations and they really treated me like 
I was special. And I really know that if any of you guys go, you're gonna you're gonna feel like you're getting a good deal and you're gonna feel like you're being treated special because you are special. Like remember when you're buying a car, it's in your own terms, it's your money, and you're the one that gets to make the rules. So that's gonna be it for me you guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you enjoyed hanging out with me let me know if you guys like the sound quality with the mic or if it's a bust if i should just like leave it but yeah look at this girl she's like hi mom i missed you you were gone all day mira que bonita se ve con tus patitas hermosa mi bebe so yeah i'm gonna go relax now you guys because i'm tired literally i did two things and i'm like oh so tired let's get up Les queremos mucho. I love you guys with all, 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 all my heart, you guys. Quédate mucho, respétate más, que Dios los bendiga. Les mando todo el amor del mundo. And I'll see you at the next video. Bye.